put this gown on. On a scale of one to ten, how nervous are you now? I'm nervous. I didn't realize I was gonna get a peep show. I was just sitting there, boobs out, and she was like, "Okay, turn this way, this way, this way, this way, this way," and it was really humbling, you guys. And um, don't take any medicine for regular, just vitamins. Yeah. Sign your name on the dotted bed. What was, dude, someone's how, playing with us. How do you just rip insane amounts of ass all the time? Oh, sweet mama, boys and girls. Good morning, Jake Paul. I have a fart problem. Okay, um, Jack walked in here just to, to prop dust me, hotbox the room with his fart, and then just left. Um, so excuse me. we are on bad terms this morning. I put my love in the air Jack, it's not using so my asshole. It's not so fun. Bad. It did? Okay, stop cussing! Go no F word for you. Whenever you fart, you gas me with your farts, I'm allowed to cuss. No! By the way, guys, I built this keyboard. Um, P O R A. It's very dark right now. I'm aware. I'm just hoping. Hold on. Okay, that's not going to work at all. Here we go. Boom. Oh, yes. Eyesight. We love it. This happened yesterday. I thought, you know what? I'm gonna be a handyman. I'm gonna surprise JC and I'm gonna upgrade the bathroom with a new light thingy. No, this is obviously not what it's supposed to look like. It's not supposed to hang down like that, okay? You're not supposed to be able to swing from it. That's usually a problem. And there's also not supposed to be a gaping hole right here. Good morning, everyone. I have my Celsius. I'm actually trying to cut back on caffeine because I realized I drank 200 milligrams a day and I started getting like heart palpations. Like I started getting chest pain. And if nursing school has taught me one thing, it's taught me that that is bad. So you don't want do chest Adderall. pain. Don't do Adderall, guys. Today we were we are on our way to the consultation for my boob job, my breast augmentation. So there's a lot of emotions today. Um, I'm one. Really, really nervous. Turning right. Because I've had, do you know where you're going? No. Go. Yeah, wait, where am I going? You're going towards the hospital. Which hospital? The, the, the one to the right. Well, good thing I took a ride, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of emotions today. I'm super nervous because I've heard of so many horror stories with um, breast augmentations and breast implants. I'm super scared of breast implant illness, but I've done a lot of research and I've talked to a lot of people that have used this surgeon, so that's just kind of a risk I'm willing to take. And, and we want boobies, baby. We do want boobies. I'm also really excited. I would say more so than nervous because we've been talking about this for so so long getting a boob job but I kept pushing it back because I was like do I actually want this do I actually want a boob job but I'm finally to a point where I'm like yes I actually want this like I'm doing this for me and I'm actually like kind of proud of myself for just taking that initiative to do something for myself and like not care about what other people think about it so yay we're excited the center for plastic surgery do you think they got some titties for sale I hope so me too as soon as that door closes I'm ripping ass. Jack, please don't. They smell oh, so bad. It's happening. They smell so bad. It's happening. You're gonna wish you had a mask on. Oh, oh, here it comes. Here's the, oh, I can feel my bowels moving. Ooh, butthole perking. Oh, you got lucky this time, babe. <laughs> Are you nervous? Yeah, a little bit. We just got done with our interrogation. Uh, she oh my just God, left. Oh made me sign so many like forms. Yeah, <laughs> you'd think that you were about to be crucified or something. Got like, nervous. It but was crazy. There were so many. My hand is cramping from. I writing. also realized she doesn't have my phone number memorized or her mother's phone number memorized. Yeah, I had to like put down like who a HIPAA form. Part of it is if you go on the internet and you Google breast implants, mm -hmm. you will see something called breast implant illness. Yeah. What was, dude, someone's How playing with us. do you have so much gas to rip? How do you just rip insane amounts of ass all the time? It blows my mind, Jack. Hey, we're here to talk about you today. <laughs> all right, this is, babe, this is your it's day. It's absolutely insane. I don't know, sweetheart, you're embarrassing me. Just because I film it and put it on the internet for anyone to see doesn't mean you should make fun of me for so it. Bad. Devices that were already on the market, including breast implants, were grandfathered in. Put this gown on. 
On a scale of 1 to 10, how nervous are you now? I'm nervous. I didn't realize I was going to get a peep show. He started talking so fast, and I was like, oh, I didn't know what he was talking about. Half yeah, time. as soon as the camera turned off, he, he got more comfortable. And, yeah. yeah. It's okay. You know, not everyone's built for the clout. No, he just doesn't want to get in trouble. I, totally I understand get it. that. But no, that was a lot of information that was thrown at me so fast. Can you summarize it? Um... No, because I don't really know. I'm going to have to have him repeat it. He said the saline ones are better. The saline ones are better because there's less complications, um, but they don't feel as natural, but I think I'm going to go with that. And then I think I'm going to get the one under the armpit. The incision under the armpit, and it's going to go under my muscle. What? I, I missed that part. Yeah, because so they have it, you can put it through the nipple, or you can put it underneath, like right here. Yeah. Or you can put it through the armpit. And he's like, I like the one in the armpit because it's like... It's easier to hide, and it just looks better. So okay. I think we're going to do that one. Maybe you're... Okay. <laughs> Couple goals. This is confusing. Look at that. This is the weirdest gown I've ever seen in my life. It looks like a poncho. It's something I'd imagine you wearing, though. You, this is the type of thing you'd wear out in a field and go take pictures, and then like force spin. me to sh show me all of them for an hour. Do you just splash my nipples? We hope. Okay, thank you. Alright, thanks. Bye, ladies. Bye. 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 Okay, they just took pictures of me. They took five different pictures and I felt so exposed. I was just sitting there, boobs out, and she was like, okay, turn this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. And it was really humbling, you guys. In other words, tomorrow the OnlyFans <laughs> is launching, guys. Be ready. No, but it was very, very, I felt, I felt exposed because I was exposed. So. Sign your name on the dotted, babe. Signing. Yes. Keeping it confidential. The, the second? June 2nd? Yes, the second's only. June, February, March, April, May, June. <laughs> I always Good job, babe. That. Well, guys, long story short, they're going to have to amputate. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like... That's so exciting. I got everything scheduled. I didn't think it'd be that quick and fast. And that was quick and fast. We were in there for like an hour. I was starving, Jack blowing ass. Play. I was miserable. We were in there for 15 minutes and Jack's like, I want to go home. <laughs> Why are we here so long? And it was like 15 minutes. I was like, Jack, yeah. what? Yeah, I can't, I won't lie. But a, a shout out to um, the titty doctor. <laughs> he did great. Camera made him a little nervous. But fortunately, I, we, I think we got the content that y'all were looking for. And now we're excited. It's also not going to cost as much as we had initially. Uh, surgery is scheduled for January 10th. So you guys can only imagine the amount of clickbait we're going to be getting on those few weeks. Okay, so I know we couldn't film a lot of it just because our doctor wasn't comfortable and because half the time my titties were out and that just wouldn't fly on YouTube. But I'm going to kind of summarize it for you guys. So basically I'm going to get a saline implant because there are less complications with it and it's going to be through the armpit. Like right here, which I didn't even know was an option instead of underneath the boob. Because he said, since I'm so small, you'd be able to see the scars. And because I'm darker pigmented, the scars would for sure show up. And I have to go online and just like look at a bunch of pictures of titties and decide which ones I want and which ones I don't want and yeah. just send them all in. So if you guys are watching this, <laughs> make sure you DM me a bunch of boobs so that I can start doing <laughs> You're obnoxious. You're obnoxious. Drive so we can go get lunch. We're going to get lunch and you're paying. That was fucking funny. Oh my Sometimes gosh. I say shit and I'm like, God, I wish I hadn't. But that one was one of those where I was like, ah, you're that right. was... But yeah, so as soon as we get home, I'm going to go on that website and look at some titties and figure out what I want mine to look like. Um, they're going under the muscle which I'm pretty sure most surgeons do just because it makes it look more natural and it doesn't interfere with breastfeeding and stuff. It's also only going to cost about five grand, which I thought it was going to cost more. <laughs> I, I really did. So that was pleasant to see. I was like, oh yeah, you're right. We don't live in LA. Yeah. So four, five grand and we're doing it January 10th. January 10th. What else? Is there any more information that they need? Um, like pretend that someone that is looking to get their boob job like, what? I mean, I'm. He said the range was gonna be around 200 to 250 cc's, what which does is that mean? that's the size of the implant. That's how small it is, or that's how no, not small. Yeah, that's how big like the actual implant is. That's like the size of the the fluid. 
It sounds like it's in CC. When you're trying to decide how hard, like the difficulty <laughs> of Mario Kart. So 200, 200 CC, 250 CCs is what he said. He predicts I'm gonna be. I said around a C cup, but it's hard to say like I want this cup because. You can go to two different stores and get a bra that's a C cup and they're two completely different sizes. If he says 250, 200. Go 200. Well, I Well, 200 say, is like the smallest you can not get. Gonna, I'm not acting like I'm the expert, but I've just, I, I feel like this goes as well with lip fillers, all right? Whatever you think you want, go down a size. I just, I just feel like that's hard to regret. You I know what I mean? I got my lips done. What? I got my lips done. I might have to get them redone because they kind of deflated. <laughs> okay, but whatever. I'm just saying. I think that like it, I don't want you to come out of there looking like a whole new woman, and I got I gotta like I can I have a really hard time making eye contact with you. Well, I'm gonna have a lot of pictures. I'm for sure not gonna go too big because I just don't think that would look normal on me. He also explained that you could have them go, like he can like do different techniques and stuff to make them literally like feel different, look different. You need to make them not go out to the left and the right. Just make them perky. Well, yeah. Well, 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 yeah. But like a lot of people don't. He's do like, that. make sure, JC, they're not lopsided. No, that's not what I'm saying. Some people like their boobs to kind of go out, like fill their chest all the way. Oh yeah. Whereas, like I'm saying, you want them to just be perky. Mine are definitely gonna be. The diameter is gonna be smaller because he said since I have such a narrow chest wall, the diameter is gonna be smaller and they're gonna come out more. He also than said usual. that you'll you might lose feeling in your nipple, which would mean you could get your nipple pierced without much I issue. just don't want to do that I don't think I want my nipples pierced <laughs> why why that sounds really painful I'm into that that sounds so painful I like that I'm trying to think of other information it's the culture that he told me but nothing's coming to my head but I'll probably wake up tonight at midnight and think of a million things that I have to tell you guys um do you have anything else you need to say Jack um no. Okay. Well, we'll see you in the next one.